Hello everybody from Quantico Marine Corps Base again. We are here now to salute Ta -da! Staff Sergeant Rex. And here to explain to us um, the significance of this very special statue. I just learned that it's actually not a he but a she. Ah! Okay, the whole time I've been saying it's a he, but that is such a I'm a, I'm a girl, I'm a girl, why do you I do know that? Better. I know. Right. Well, First of all, Gwen, thank you so much. Look at her foot. But and she, styling the boot. She's styling in pink <laughs> as well, but she's a Marine, former Marine. So Once a Marine, always a Marine. Exactly. So speaking of once a Marine, I know Staff Sergeant is a Marine. I right. mean, Staff Sergeant Reckless is a Marine. Right. So Staff Sergeant Reckless um, is famous uh, for her actions in Korea. They were humping, you see the, the cylinders on her back. Those were um, the mortar rounds. And so they were having to carry those up the hill and go back and forth. And a young lieutenant thought, we should have a workhorse for this. So he went to the racetracks and um, found this young boy who was selling his horse. Now he had hoped that she would be a racehorse. Okay. But he needed money to buy a prosthetic for his sister. Oh. Uh, so he sold Reckless. I can't remember what her name was before she became reckless, but he sold her to this young lieutenant. He took, the lieutenant took her back to the front lines and she humped the ammunition and food and supplies up the hill and back down. It took her a little, you know, couple of trips to not be afraid of the, the rounds going off. And then um, she got used to that and she could go back and forth by herself and she even carried some wounded back down the hill. So after the war, when she was in the camp, not in action, she became a, she would stick her head into their tents and um, eat their cards sometimes as they were playing cards. She loved beer. She <laughs> ate funny. birthday cake for the, the Marine Corps birthday. Uh -huh. And she came home with the, um, the Marines and lived out the rest of her life in Camp Pendleton, California, where she's buried. That's so, near San Diego, right? It is near San Diego. So I think I'm going to somehow visit there because I visited her in Kentucky State Kentucky. Park and now in Quantico. I know the third one is in uh, where is. she is buried. So I have to go and I'm here. Here, one for you, one for me. We're going to display this to thank her because she saved so many lives. Yes, she did. I'm so sorry for calling you he. Oh my God, I should have known better. It's like... Okay, well, this was dedicated in 2013, so it's very still relatively new. Um, and do you know how, like, what inspired somebody, right? Robin Hutton um, was just, she's just a, a woman who was interested in, in animals, and she became interested in Reckless, mm. and then she became interested in the Korean War. Mm and talked to many mm. veterans who served with Reckless. Mm. Um, Harold Wadley was one of them, mm. and he was here when we dedicated the monument. But Robin just became very passionate about Reckless. Mm. She wrote a book about her. Oh, I would have to read it. Uh, What's the book. name of the book? It's, it's called Sergeant Reckless. Oh, duh. Google Amazon book, everybody. But um, and so then once she had written the book, done all this research, she said there needs to be memorials oh. to her. So the first one was here at the National Museum of the Marine Corps. Nice. Um, she thought that seemed only appropriate that it should be here in the park um, where Marines are memorialized every day. Again here, I'm just not here so that I could show you this beautiful statue, but she is uh, official, has the official rank as staff sergeant yes, and the military decoration two purple hearts good conduct medal and presidential unit citation navy unit commendation oh boy national defense service medal united nations service medal korea korean service medal with three stars and republic of korea presidential unit citation so she is a force to be reckoned with yes. and here we honor Staff Sergeant Reckless, thank you for your service. And everybody, again, this was such a wonderful visit. Thank you so much, Gwen. Wow, it's, I think, my last one before July 27th. 
So thanks everybody for joining me in my 50 state, 70 plus plus 90 city journey across America to honor veterans. Thank you so much everybody. See you tomorrow.